What is up guys? It is Tony here and today we are bringing you a PC build. Today we're doing something a little bit different. We are doing a build that includes monitors. We are doing this because I had a couple people request that I do builds that kind of meet some sort of goal. A goal of running triple monitors for example. And that is the goal of this PC. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into the build. So for the processor, we're going with a little bit more of a value processor. We're going with the 6350, which is plenty powerful, can handle three monitors, and is also ready to handle Crossfire with AMD or NVIDIA's SLI. For the motherboard, we're going with this MSI board, which of course is another value type of board. Just $70 gets you SLI Crossfire ready, uh, supports the processor we are using, and also supports some pretty high speed RAM. For the RAM, we're going to go with G-Scale Rip Jaws. We're only going with one 4GB stick, but it's a high-speed memory, and it's also available to upgrade down the road, but this is enough for running Surround or Ifinity or whatever you're going to be running. For the graphics card, we're going with AMD, the 270X, which is a 4GB RAM card with 1280 stream processors, and yes, we are only going with one because one can support three monitors, believe it or not. For the hard drive, we're going with a smaller hard drive. We need to make more room in the budget for the monitors. So we're going with 500 gigabyte Western Digital. Nothing too special. Down the road, you can put in an SSD if you need to, but this will do the job for now. For the power supply, we're going with the Corsair GS series, 700 watts, which could support SLI or Crossfire. This is also Haswell certified, even though we're not using Haswell. But this is all around a very good value for a power supply. And for the case, we're going with a very cheap case here. If you have room to increase your budget, I would recommend getting a better case. But we're going to go with the Thermaltake V4. This is actually a really nice case for $40, and I think that it's a great value for what you pay. And for the monitors, we're going with three of these Asus VS 228s. You actually get 1080p in a $130 monitor, which is a very good value, and it's 21.5 inches. So that is pretty much it for the $1,000 triple monitor gaming PC. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. The point of this build is to try to get a triple monitor setup PC with all of the parts and the monitors included in the price. Uh, I know some of the parts are a little bit cheaper than they could be, and I know all around this could be a better system for a triple monitor setup, but keep in mind the point of this build video is to stay within a $1,000 budget. So keep that in mind. This is a great build. I would recommend possibly getting yourself a better case and maybe a little bit extra RAM and a better hard drive, but all around, this build, if you only have $1,000, is very good. It's a good starting point, and down the road, you can upgrade it and modify it to work better. Those monitors, by the way, they are extremely good. I am an Asus supporter. I have lots of Asus monitors sitting around my room right now, and they all work extremely well. So that is it, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. We will have more later this week on Friday and next week, and the week after that, and the week after that. So, glad you guys enjoyed this. If you did, leave a like, leave a comment, do whatever you want. It's up to you, but I'll see you guys next time.